Hello pod two. Today we're going to learn about quadrilaterals. Let's learn the names of some of them. Quadrilateral means four sided shapes. So let's start at the beginning. This is a parallelogram, which is kind of hard to say. Try it with me. Parallelogram. A parallelogram, the sides that are opposite are equal or parallel. Parallel means that there are two lines that are going in the same direction, but they will never touch. So if we look at this, parallel lines, we have one here and one there, and then one at the bottom and one at the top. They are parallel, and that's why we call this a parallelogram. Rhombus. Can you say that? Rhombus. Rhombus, the opposite size, are parallel, so opposite. This side and this side are parallel, and this side and this side are parallel. And the all, all sides, they're all equal. So this side and this side and this side and this side are all the same length. And that is a rhombus. Now you all know what that is. Tell me what it is. It's a rectangle. So we know with a rectangle that the opposite sides are parallel and equal. So if we look, this side and this side are parallel and equal, the same distance and length. This side and this side are also parallel and the same length. And that again is a rectangle. You know what this one is too, don't you? It is a square. That's right, a square, the opposite sides are parallel, which we know, and all sides are equal, right? So that's this side, this one, this one, and this one. All four sides are equal, and you know that's a square. Next up, this is called a kite. So exactly two pairs of the consecutive sides are equal. So at the top, that side and that side are equal. And the two on the bottom, that side and that side, they too are equal. That is a kite. Lastly, this is a trapezoid. Can you say that? Trapezoid. So there's only one pair of opposite sides that are parallel. So can you show me which ones are parallel if you look at the trapezoids? Hmm. Can you figure it out? Well, the bottom and the top. Those two are parallel. That's right. The one on either side, they are not. So a trapezoid has one pair of opposite sides. Okay? And that is all of the quadrilaterals we're going to learn today. Go over the names of them, and when you're done, let's see you complete the worksheet that I've attached. Good luck!